Now, Dagon, the false god, had a torso of a fish. He had the body of a fish, but the head and the arms of a man. So he was this half man, half fish, sea creature who was worshipped as the chief deity by the Philistines. Dagon, interestingly, was also considered the father of Baal. So you hear about Baal a lot in the Bible, but Dagon was considered even superior to Baal. And I want to take a minute here to compare the practices of the Roman Catholic Church to the fish god Dagon. Do you ever wonder why the bishops and the pope of the Roman Catholic Church wear a mitre upon their head? What's a mitre? That's that pointed, that white pointed funny hat with a top that looks like a fish with an open mouth. Well, this began around the 11th century, and it's supposed to represent, according to Roman Catholic churches or sources, the splendor of the holiness embodied by the bishop, his dignity and authority. Okay, that's what the Roman Catholics will say this, you know, this funny looking fish hat with an open mouth, but I'm not sure how a hat shaped like a fish with an open mouth represents splendor or holiness in any way. But it is eerily similar to the headdress that the priests of Dagon wore. You can see it in these side-by-side -side pictures if you pull these pictures up online. Dagon was the chief deity of the Philistines and was the father of Baal, but the Roman Catholic Church sources claim that each of the two folds at the top of the mitre represent the Old and the New Testaments, and that it was developed after the tiara or crown that the bishops wore. So you also have Mariolatry within the Roman Catholic Church, the worship of Mary as the Mediatrix and the Queen of Heaven. In the Bible, there was also Ashtaroth or Ishtar, who is called the Queen of Heaven. Ashtaroth was the wife or consort of Baal. So when we consider that Dagon, the fish god, is the father of Baal, and Baal and Ashtaroth are his children, the connections between these Mesopotamian false gods and goddesses and you know, the worship of the Virgin Mary as the queen of heaven and the bishops and the pope wearing this, this fish hat, uh, this should at least raise some eyebrows.